With no end in sight to the drought, the city and organizers had to take extra steps to ensure water conservation was top of mind for the slippery slide down Lonsdale Avenue. Nadia Stewart has more. It isn't every day a busy city street transforms into a giant water slide. I haven't been on it yet, but I'm pretty excited to go on it. But in North Vancouver, 6,000 people were lining up today, all for the chance to slide their city. Once in a lifetime opportunity, that's kind of where I'm at with it. I think it's pretty cool. It's epic, yeah. Totally, yeah. I should do this all the time. This is great, yeah. Since 8 this morning, people have been waiting to zip down a 1,000-foot stretch of Lonsdale Avenue. At times, the queue sneaking up the street. All of this amidst stage 3 water restrictions in the city and metro area. We are not using metro water, so we're not breaking any rules. Even if we were using metro water, we would still be allowed to put this on today. If it was stage 4, we would stop it. But it's only stage 3, so we're allowed to carry on. Carrying on responsibly. All of the water is being trucked in from Abbotsford, a city not grappling with restrictions. The water that comes out here is collected in this pool at the bottom. It's filtered, tested, then recirculated. The cost covered entirely by the organizers. A lot of states, a lot of provinces have been affected by the drought, so and water conservation is really important to us as well. So we are willing to go to whatever lengths we need to to make sure that we have a fun event, but that we're also taking care of the needs of the community. And there were at least two other cities in Metro Vancouver that were thinking about hosting Slide the City, but it was only North Vancouver that was actually able to make it happen. There is already talk of bringing the event back here next year. We certainly will evaluate this at the end of the day to make sure that it was what we thought it was. And if there was uh, no major problems, I hope to see it back next year. And in case you were wondering, this is what it looks like on the way down. A bit bumpy, but undeniably fun. Nadia Stewart, Global News.